You're watching Singapore Tonight. New technology has been helping rail transport operators find defects at least twice as quickly and a hundred times more accurately. This helps to reduce human error while performing maintenance checks, while data also helps staff make timely interventions. Here's a look at what goes on behind the scenes. Man. Checking for cracks in rails used to be a manual process, with staff having to pause to take readings every few metres. So there, there's a gauge and he's reading off the reading. In comparison, this laser track trolley now makes the process significantly smoother for engineers like Reiko Kwa. Laser heads, the ones in black, they measure the railway profile. You can see that it's capturing the whole profile. Extended arms, it will be pointing towards the traction power rail and it will measure the height with respect to the running rail. And at the end of the run, the inspection run will be converted into a data file. So when we review the data reports, we can identify the issues or the out-of-tolerance specifications and we can highlight them to trigger the maintenance team timely for rectifications. Locating defects has also been narrowed down to within a half a metre compared to 50 metres before, making it easier for staff to find cracks quickly. The length of rail that can be checked every night has also more than doubled. It's also easily deployable to any kind of site because of its weight and also its compactness. So just two or three people will be able to set it down and it can manoeuvre the different curves, especially in depot tracks that we see many turnouts, so it can easily go through these many tracks as well. When the city's asleep, works along the tracks begin. SBS Transit's Rail Rover heads out from 1.30 a.m. The latest version has been inspecting the downtown line since March. It covers around 4.5 kilometres of rail per night, completing the entire downtown line in just 20 days. It would previously have taken two years manually. SBS Transit says the rover has also helped to reduce human error and is able to immediately notify staff of issues as well. The staff appreciate that technology actually helps them to analyse better. It actually obscures themselves. The data helps them to have confidence that what they have checked at the track site is validated with the data. Plans are on track to roll out the rover to the northeast line in 2027.